GBPAUD guys you get me so as you can see guys watch the previous video just to see what's going on right here so price is taking a deeper retracement because on the daily I thought they were gonna go back turn back and continue bearish within this direction but as you can see what happened we did get a reaction here we wicked this thing and came back down and wicked this thing and came back in all the way down here and came back and closed bullish again but today bro we just gotta buy off you get me going into the lower time frames let's just see what is happening <clears throat> price is taking a deeper retracement guys that's all I don't want you to get that confused price is taking a deeper retracement so how I'm gonna trade this moving forward right now as you can see price is really really pushing higher guys really really pushing higher and we broke this area right now so I'm gonna be looking for this area right now right here this is my new area which I'm looking for price to turn on the four hour I'm just gonna stretch it over here to see if I'm getting it I'm gonna get a reaction here for structures a reaction here for structures to shift most probably on the five minute you know I'm gonna look for the five minute to see if structures are gonna shift bearish right here let me just see this thing oh, it's a, okay also on the five minute away and then uh, what else what else can I pick up from this thing so if it doesn't I'm gonna look for a break of this high right here where they are now let me just put a line here a bullish one yes so if structure breaks this high right here I'm gonna take that retest structure is gonna break like so I'm gonna take the retest because as you can see they are breaking highs guys but please mind you bruh I'm not focused on buys at the moment I'm really not focused on buys guys I don't wanna lie I'm really not focused on buys currently because we are in a bearish trend bruh but then you can take advantage of these opportunities price can come back and retest these areas right here retest these areas right here you get me retest these areas if it breaks if you get a body close above here body close above here price might most likely come back and retest if you get a body close above here come back and retest and continue higher same thing when you get to this high you're gonna treat it the same way you get me you're gonna wait for a body close above this area right here and continue higher because we might be going for a hundred percent retracement who knows no one knows so that's it for gbp aud on the four hour uh i'm just gonna let this appear only on the four hour and then going into the one hour guys going into the one hour as you can see they are breaking one hour structures they are about to break one hour structures right now so same thing guys if i get a body close above the one hour right here this was my one hour structure as you can see this was bearish let me just delete this line oh this line is the four hour one that i put it's this one so let me just make it up here on the four hour only on the 4h only because i need it on the 4h yep and then going into the one hour it's not there so as you can see one hour this was my bearish trading zone in the one hour right here so this from this move from down up here to down here this was my bearish trading zone one hour only red i just wanted to change this to red okay this was my bearish trading zone so as you can see guys if i do get a body close above here i'm gonna take the retest i'm gonna take the retest and go higher and go higher and go higher guys that's what i'm gonna do that's what i'm gonna do for gbpaed because as you can see price is taking a deeper retracement bruh price is taking a deeper retracement this is not what we were expecting we're expecting this thing to continue to, to yeah we we were expecting a pullback but we didn't know how deep it's gonna be we don't know how deep it's gonna be so you get me we don't know how deep it's gonna be but 
at the moment this is what we're dealing with right now so i am looking at this area very closely though the high this area very closely i am looking at it let me just highlight it here this is the high right there i am look they, they and they they right there bro i am looking at it closely because what can happen price might shift on the five minute and start giving us bearish structures bro so if the five minute does something like this goes down and start breaking structures like this this is here's what i mean guys if the five minutes starts doing something like this i'm gonna be looking to to sell to take these cells right here on the retest and continue selling downwards so that's why i keep on emphasizing on the five minute that's what i'm gonna do but at the moment as you can see guys i'm waiting for a body close above here retest and push higher but then the five minute will dictate also my entries you know so that's it for GBP AUD. I'm going to move on to NASDAQ.